Attraction. Attraction. The Study of Life by Ron Fleming. Chapter 12. Look around in your room and take a look at all the stuff you have. These are the things you think about. This is what you attract. Now look at the type of people and the quality of friends you have in your life. These are the people you attract with your thoughts. Your thoughts attract other people with similar attitudes, beliefs, habits, clothes, and a whole multitude of other things. With that said, would you agree that our thoughts help create or manifest our reality? Well they do. This is why we must control our mind, and not let our mind control us. It's important to be careful of what you think about, because you might unknowingly attract or manifest it. This leads us to a secret power that people are just now realizing. It's the law of attraction. This law suggests that anything you think about long enough, will eventually manifest in one form or another. This goes for money, cars, homes, love, vacations, success or anything else you want. If you think about it long enough it will appear. You might not recognize it at first so you have to stay consciously aware. Have you ever thought about someone you haven't heard from in a long time, and you get a random call from them? I don't know how but your thoughts manifested them. When you think about something long enough, you begin to subconsciously obsess about it. Then you want to learn more about what you want from it. Then you start meeting people with the same interest that help with questions to your answers, which in turn brings you closer to what you desire. By the time you finally receive your manifestation, it won't be such a big deal because you will have thought about every aspect of it. The above paragraph would be considered a positive manifestation. If you don't control your thinking you can create an unwanted negative manifestation. When you constantly think about your pain, suffering, anger, depression, loneliness, heartache, handicaps and other negative things in your life, you are just inviting more of the same. So only think about the things you want in life, don't think about things you don't want. Because whatever you think about long enough will eventually manifest, good or bad. Your mind is a garden, and your thoughts are your seeds. Plant only the seeds you want to grow, and they will manifest.